Hey, what's up, guys? It's Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, we're talking video editing. In particular, we're talking DaVinci Resolve. It's made by Blackmagic Design. I'm on their website right here. And this is, without a doubt, the most feature complete, best free video editor you can use. I got to put that in parentheses. It is free. It's a free video editor, whereas a lot of video editors are either free and they're like free to play and they're not really good because you get watermarks when you render things out or you got to keep buying and buying and buying stuff like other, other uh, video editors that we've featured on here. So it's the best free one by quite a margin. There are some caveats though. First off guys, it is not, it, it's complex. It's not a simple piece of software. This is industrial grade used in real cinema movies. This is used by Hollywood, especially for color grading. It's the real deal. The second thing is, well, it's overwhelming. If you're new to video editing, or even if you're transferring in from a previous video editor, like Premiere Pro, for example, yeah, it's going to take a little while for you to get used to it. It is not uh, a simple program to use. So I tell you that, those caveats out of the way, because now I'm going to show you how to download it. I'm going to show you how to install it. And then I'm also going to tell you that in the future, I'm going to be doing a huge program or a huge series of videos that's going to show you how to become the best video editor you know. Anyways, let's get right into this. The first thing here, if you want to follow along with me, you go to blackmagicdesign.com, click on products. When you do that, we're going to now go and get the software. So this is the first part of installing it. You'll see here when I click on products, all of these different things on here, all these cameras, uh, hardware, it's just hardware galore, right? Blackmagic cameras, etc., etc. Anyways, go down, halfway down the page, you're going to see DaVinci Resolve and click on it. When you do that, you're going to come to this page here, the DaVinci Resolve page. And again, this is this is Hollywood style stuff. And you're going to see that you can now download DaVinci Resolve for free. Uh, click on that. You get two options. One, Resolve 18 Beta. It's currently in Beta 6. So it's been going through a few iterations and it's pretty stable and it works great. Uh, but again, it's in Beta or you can use the stable version of Resolve 17 also really, really good. Doesn't have quite all the new features, but yeah, you don't always use them. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and use the uh, 6 or the 18 beta 6. And as I do that, you'll see here that it's going to ask me to fill out my name and information. Just go ahead and do that. Once you do that, you'll get the option to download it. Now, let's talk about the program. It, again, it's very, very, it, it, it's complex. It's overwhelming. But a lot of you are probably thinking, why is it free? Why would they give this away free? Two things, two real reasons. One, well, no, three maybe. One, they're competing with Adobe. If you use Premiere Pro and After Effects and Photoshop, you know, they've got that whole ecosystem and they want to compete with them and they don't want to compete on a monthly fee like Adobe charges. So like it or not like it, these guys run free. The second reason why is they sell all that hardware like I showed you. They sell tens and thousands and thousands of dollars of pieces of hardware, cameras, lenses, all that stuff. And all of that is integrated to work quite nicely with DaVinci Resolve 18. And the third real reason is because they've got a Pro Studio version. It has 50 effects that are not in the standard version that you can get. So just keep that in mind. It's not. It sounds too good to be true, but there's a reason behind it. Anyways, fill that out, and you're going to get a .dmg file or a .exe file. Once you do that, you're going to be able to add in DaVinci Resolve. I'm just going to click on it, and I'm going to open it. And this is what you get when you start adding in stuff. So I've had... This is a fresh installation. If I want to create a project, you just go add to project library. Actually, you know what? I'm not even going to do that. I'm just going to cancel that. I'm just going to click untitled project and I'm going to start creating stuff, right? So I'm just, there we go. I double clicked on it. Here is the software. This is it open. It's in different pages. It's completely different than what you've seen at Premiere Pro. I'm going to teach you how to be the best video editor, you know, but here it is, guys. That's how you download it. That's why you want to consider it. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.